this is the beginning of part three of the video on how to use the dynamic views module from data springs to display data saved via the dynamic forms module so up until this point in the previous videos we have covered how to use the item template and the detail template now let's explore this module the dynamic views module a little bit further and let's see how we can work with filters and how we can work with search options as well so if we go back to the back end of our module and if I click on module configuration, if I scroll all the way down, as I said, lots of different options here, not going to explore each one of those, but I'm going to mention a couple here. Records per page, you can specify how many records you want to show in each page. If you want to have columns, if you want to repeat the entries vertically or horizontally, you can also specify what is this sorted field? You can select a field to sort by. You can specify if it's ascending, descending. You can say which roles will have access to export as an Excel, export as a PDF. Now we also have page sizing that we can say how many how many uh, records will be displayed per page. Not going to explore all of that. I'm going to go straight to filter. So. I may want to filter the results of this page automatically. I may say, you know, just show the records, the entries, based on a certain condition that I want to, to, to implement. Let's say, I may want to say that um, I just want to show records from how did you hear about us equals to, let's say, Yahoo. If I click... If I click add, now I'm going to, I'm not going to add the second one, but I'm just going to save this. Now, I'm assuming that if when I go back to see the results, nothing will show up because there's no Yahoo there. So let's refresh this. Perfect. So no entries are showing up because I'm filtering based on a fixed condition. Now, if I go back there, I could put this equals to Google. I could save this again. Now. If I go back, refresh this, it's not showing yet. I think I did something wrong here. Let me try first to delete, delete. I'm going to add again equals to Google. Let's see if it will work this time. Click save, go back there, refresh, nope. I'm gonna go click on add and save this. This should do it. Refresh, now. Okay, I have just deleted again. Let's try this one more time. How do you hear about us equals to Google? Let's save this. Okay, now refresh the page. Everything is coming back to normal. Now, the last feature that I want to try from this mod, this module, is the search capability so let's go back to admin to the admin view and let's go to the search fields now here under field name you can select which field you want to filter by you want to search by so let's select name and the condition that i want to apply is contains search label i'm going to call this name and I'm not gonna put any default. Let me just keep it like, like this. Not gonna put anything else here. I'm just click update. And let's see how it looks like now. Let's refresh this. Okay, for some reason it's not showing up yet. Maybe if we go back here and let's have a look at module configuration. And there is a there's a, an area that says search. Now things here seems to be okay. Let's go back to search again. No default value, name. Okay, so let me edit this again. Now, there's this option here, searchable. 
I think that I didn't check this one. I'm sure that I didn't. So I'm guessing that I have to check it in order to be able to put it there. So to be able to, to display it, to display this search condition. So searchable right now is checked. Now let's go back once again, refresh this. And we, here we have name contains, and then let's say uh, DER. Let's see if this will search properly. Okay, perfect. So it's filtering by my name here. So let's say John. Perfect filtered. So if I delete this search should should show up everything, which it did. Now I can add more more criteria here, more 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 filters. Let's say that I want to add a, how did you hear about us as well, and I want to have the same type of condition contains search label is here about and this is searchable which I forgot last time I'm gonna click update now we have two conditions that uh, actually uh, yes uh, yeah so we have two conditions both of them are searchable let's go back to Internet Explorer refresh this I do have both conditions here, here about, let's say that we put Yahoo search, no results. If we put Google, show both of them. So we have pretty much covered the, the main features of the dynamic views module from data springs. Uh, we were able to connect the views module the dynamic views module with a dynamic forms module to display the information stored there. We, we, we were able to create a list view, a detail view. We were able to do filtering. We were able to do searching. And there is a bunch of more options in this module that you can uh, turn uh, the, the templates much, much better, much richer. You can define paging, sorting, all kinds of stuff. So very interesting module, very good module to display data. You can display data from tables, from SQL statements. In our case, we focused on displaying data from the dynamic forms module. Thank you very much and bye for now.